Well, hello everyone, and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty. So, uh, yeah, I'm out here collecting berries. It's kind of old school. <laughs> it's uh, definitely a, a bit of an early game activity that is very lucrative. Uh, but somebody had a comment, and they said, you know, you could you could turn those berries into wine uh, into juice and turn that juice into wine. And I just sort of went, oh. <laughs> so yeah we might have to expand oh crud okay so those berries over there those are trolley berries i don't think i can get to them oh i can get to this one can i get oh we can get to some of these oh i can't get to those ones all right that's cool it is the uh the end and let's grab licorice here yeah, this, that over there, that's no man's land. So you saw what happens when you try to cross out of uh, out of the map. It just kicks you back a little bit. Um, I I did pick some of the other berries that are in uh, that are uh, up to this point, and let's go. Uh, I believe I picked up all of one. Yeah, these ones right here. Are all oh no no, did I miss these? I must have missed them. All right, let's go grab those. But yeah, it. Oh, oh, we got stuck there. Um, and uh, I like, yeah, I like having something in my offhand when I do this because it does, I don't know how much quicker it actually is, but it feels quicker. <laughs> and that's good enough for me. <laughs> I'm a simple dude. <laughs> Easily amused. Um, but yeah, so, uh, yeah, we can, we could, uh, you know, take advantage of, of, of summer. We could get some berries. It's kind of, you know, a little bit of an old school activity and, um, you know, it's, it's actually, uh, it's nice to get back to it. Now you can still, I think you can sell berries. They're not, Ooh, they're not really worth much, man. I think, yeah, the, see the, when the fractional pricing was added in, uh, it, yeah. So they're not as lucrative. I think they used to be, a, a like a one coin each or one, whatever. Yeah. One silver coin each. And so, you know, 820 was like 820 coins, right? But now that they have fractional uh pricing in yeah it's one tenth the cost that it used to be but we can make juice and we can we can ferment that juice to make the make some wonderful wine here we'll grab some sticks as well and uh yeah i think that's i think that's pretty good i think it's a great idea and uh a great excuse for uh why you might want to pick some berries in in late game so that's what we're here for we're just Gathering, gathering, gathering. I'm going to just gather... Uh, well, I'm not going to go too far. We could... Uh, we could go all over the map and gather... Holy crap, you're way out here. <laughs> I think that's one of my wood gatherers. Wow. He went... He's gone pretty far afield. I didn't think these, they went out all this way. That's pretty amazing. Uh, we got some more berries here. There we go. We got you. And then we got you. So yeah, we're just going to do, I don't know, we've got 946. Um, I, you know, it would be nice to hit an even thousand, but I don't think, I think there was some, oh no, there's more, no more down there. Did I miss? I think we got them. All right, let's, let's head back to uh, Licorice here and continue. Oh, that's it. <laughs> uh, continue on our uh, little, our hunt for berries. Now there is some more. Nope, not down there. Um, over near the village. So we might have to do that. I can't remember where else there are a few. I, I hit up a lot of the ones that are in and around my, my, my village. Excuse me, pardon me, important berry business coming through. You know, we could check this side of the thing. There might be some over here. Are those berries? They might be. Or they're just... Yeah, yeah, those are berries. Those, I think they're berries. Let's grab them, just in case. We'll, we'll check it out. Oh, yep. There we go. Nice. I agree, Licorice. I look forward to it as well. Licorice is uh, all uh, very excited about uh, the possibility of uh, transporting more illicit products and uh, sneaking in under Unigoth's nose. Uh, uh, and, uh, you know, <laughs> our, our little business. Uh, it just, it, it warms my heart that we are, uh, we have, a uh, you know, um, we have a little bit of a side business that's right underneath Unigoth's nose. He doesn't need to know about it. He's the tax man. He doesn't need to know about our little 
our little thing here. And don't anybody tell them. We won't. You know what? Snitches get. Snitches get stitches. Okay. How many we got? We're up. Yeah, just over a thousand. That's probably, that's probably enough. It is also getting dark. Uh, and, oh. Wow. 52. Holy moly. They're actually kind of heavy. Which is why I brought, I wasn't sure where I was going to end up weight-wise, which is why uh, <laughs> we have our, our stallion. Oh, let's go take a look at something in the fields, which is why we have our stallion here. He's he's helping me out. He's, uh, you know, he's a good sort. Um, so, this is, yeah, we're going to deal with this later. So, this these are uh, currently set to oats. So, if I were to, let's hop off and take a look. Pretty sure that they're set to oats right now. Yeah. So in the next season, um, they're going to be harvested, and we're going to have to remember to, to flip this these two fields, or I think there's two fields here. They're just really, yeah, there is. There's like a, there's the band here between them. Uh, we're going to flip the two fields over to being uh, rye. So we have to remember to do that. Um, that's really my main concern uh, as far as uh going into fall is concerned like that that's that's what i'm a bit more worried about than anything else just making sure that uh that that happens um everything else i'm pretty sure that they're they're gonna have uh they have a handle on it. it's gonna be all fine all right um i'm gonna go put away some stuff here i guess i could have ridden the horse all the way over to the resource thing well you know <laughs> it's all right uh now i'm gonna actually here, we'll, Dump the sticks. We don't need those. Okay, we've got mead bottles. I'm going to put the bottles away because they don't have mead in them. Uh, we've got linen thread that I'm going to sell, flax grain, and cabbage seeds. That and This is all stuff we can sell. And then what else do we have? Oh, there's oh, this, that's right. This is the, uh, the, the stuff that went bad. You know what? Is there anything else in the food storage that can go bad? Is there anything else waiting in the wings uh, not really. Okay, so is there anything... Oh, wow. Look at the carrot seed. Uh, let's take a look at if there's anything that's close. 50 is not too bad. Wow, everything's actually in reasonably good shape. Uh, I might be missing it, but everything looks like it's fairly fresh and new. I mean, even these mushrooms are still 62%. That's pretty good. Uh, flax grain, 682. Uh, that's because the flax that's over in the th uh, barn is being processed. Uh, now, I'm going to... That's one thing I do need to do. Let's take care of that now. Uh, we're going to flip the barn over to crops. There we go. Uh, replace... It. They're all in farmer mode right now. And I think what I'm going to do is... Well, I think we'll convert three of them over into uh, field workers. We'll keep Maynard as a as a farmer, so he can keep working on stuff inside. I don't think we need all hands on deck. So let's do, uh, yeah, 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 these three, these guys. Uh, and then we'll assign them back in as crop workers. I mean, obviously, if there's an issue, we can always pitch in, or I can, I can go in and I can... Uh, um, reassign, you know, and get everybody working on the farm, on the crops. But yeah, this is, I think this is good enough for now. It'll cover us. All right. So that's all done for, for the next season. I, I hear you. Um, oh, what I am going to do though, is I'm going to put, oh, <laughs> this wrong building. I am going to put the, uh, the berries in storage. I don't think I have any right now. No, I don't. Um, because they will go bad, partially bad, in my inventory faster than they would in here. And I, I don't, you know, I'd prefer to have nice fresh berries for my, uh, for my wine. And we'll do wine production in the fall. So we'll get into that later. Uh, I've got some Eaton cabbage. Um, oh, hey, we've got some St. John's wort. And I don't think I need that much broadleaf plantain. So let's drop off, I don't know, 13. There we go. We've got 15 left. That's good enough. And how's my food and water? It's fine. Um, I'm going to go to sleep. It gets reset uh, when we switch over to the new season. So I'm not too worried about eating. I'll drink, though, because it's free. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did you hear that? He sounded very satisfied. 
Everybody's sort of hanging out. So what do you think, everyone? Did we have a good summer? Did we enjoy ourselves? Lots of hard work. Who do we have here? We've got Seabor and Jerwazy and Ansgar. Yeah, you guys are awesome. I want to thank you all for your all your hard work. And we've got Delagor. You especially, Delagor. Uh, I, I am so impressed with my farm team. They're excellent. And then we've got, oh, look at all the people hanging out in here. Alruna. <laughs> She's a, uh, yes. And then we've got Maynard and Sheboy. Excellent. Hello, dear. How's it going? Oh, it's fine, honey. It's all good. We're just, everybody's just having a grand time. They don't look like they're having a grand time, dear. They look like they're kind of, okay. <laughs> Alruna. <laughs> you know, Alruna is very, very spooky. I'm not exactly sure. Okay, she's going to go to bed. All right, all right. <laughs> There's something about my seamstress that's not quite right. <laughs> but I do, I, 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 uh, I support her. I back up my people, and she's one of my people, so. Okay, uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to sleep. Um, let me, let's just make sure that, let me see if I can remember anything else I want to do before we flip over to the next season. Uh, I'm not worried about my food and water. Um, I'm not going to do the oat to rye flip uh, yet because I need them to harvest. I want them to harvest it for... I agree, Licorice. This is very suspicious. I'm <clears throat> okay between you and me um, all right I think I, 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 I do back up Alruna but I do wonder at her and I do wonder at her quote abilities I know I know it's very freaky I'm not you know what we're not going to talk about this any further are we licorice this is yeah this is we're just we're just gonna go with the flow all right buddy yeah we're just we're just gonna go with the flow Oh, boy. <laughs> All right. Well, as I say, um, I think we're good. Um, in the next season, um, oh, yeah, I look forward. Here, let's put away the torch. I look forward to uh, harvesting the poppies. Now, just so that we can do a, a quick last-minute check, let's go take a look at the poppies uh, just before here. Let's bring out the flashlight. The, not flashlight. <laughs> let's bring out the torch and take a look at what we're dealing with. Yeah, they're, they're, they're purple. They look really cool. And in the next season, we're going to harvest harvest them. I want to come up here and take a look at them before the uh, before my folks, my farm folk, uh, go up and, and harvest them. I want to take a look. And maybe I'll even do a little bit of the harvesting myself. All right. Um, yeah, I think this is a good place to, uh, to, to call it. So we're going to go to sleep and go into the next season. And hope that Alruna doesn't sleep kill us in the night. <laughs> Were we all sleeping in one bed? Oh my god, I don't even want to know. There we go, that's it, Rados. Teach that door a lesson. <laughs> all right, now. <laughs> okay, I'm not, I'm gonna I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna be honest. She's freaking me out a little bit, <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> All right. Anyways, that's that's fine. Let's go take a look at the uh, the poppies. <laughs> Let's go take a look at the poppies. Do 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 do. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Oh, that's uh, Gwenifa. Hey. Hi. Okay. Now I was told that they turned kind of a whitish color oh they do oh it's not no no th th these are the seed pods 
These are the seed pods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, um, in order to harvest the poppies, you need a scythe. So let's go and grab a scythe. And uh, I want to do the poppies. I, I think we can... Uh, we can let uh, the rest of the team work on some of the other, you know, like the uh, any of the grains and all of that. But I want to do the uh, I want to do the poppies. So, um, you know what? Let's grab a scythe and let's grab a sickle as well. I'm curious about the sickle because I don't really hear much uh, talked about when it comes to the sickle. So, let's see. Uh, the scythe. Let's put you in six, and the sickle. Let's put you in seven. There you go. And let's go and, uh, I mean, is is the sickle essentially like an earlier game, ver earlier version of the scythe? Or, I mean, I know logically they're different things, but I'm just not really sure. So let's start with the sickle first, actually, because it's the one I'm not sure about. So no. Okay. Oh, you. it does actually. Oh, look at that. Okay. All right. Or not. Okay, he's obvious. Wow, he's super exhausted doing this. How come this one... These poppies can't be harvested, apparently. But these ones can. What is going on? That is really... Why is this not... All right, I am not. I am not um, gonna worry about it. <laughs> Is it? Am I looking at the wrong? Oh, okay. So there must be some sort of hitbox issue. So this, the sickle appears to do a single swipe. Yeah, a single swipe harvests. All right. Okay. Oh, buddy. All right. <laughs> is, are you going to... Okay. <laughs> That's fine. All right. And then we've got the scythe. Oh, it does more than one thing. Oh. Okay. Okay. So it's more efficient. There you go. That explains everything. Holy moly. It actually does quite a bit. You can... Wow, this is impressive. I had no idea that the, the scythe... See, I hadn't done... Excuse me. <laughs> you should never walk between... Uh, in front of a scythe, my friend. That's uh, that's not healthy. Yeah, like, it, that was three. Holy moly. So it does a really good job. Okay, all right. So that's the advantage. So the, the, the sickle can do small uh, amounts, like one at a time. And the scythe can do uh, larger swaths of uh, material. So, so there we go. We've harvested all of the poppies. Okay. You know what, buddy? Put that away. There we go. And uh, let's take a look. I'm going to put the tools away. I'm going to put them back in the, uh, into, the, into storage. And then do we have another horse? <gasps> Wait a minute. We got... Okay, is that still cranberry? I forgot to check. Actually, we can look at it here. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. Oh, right. Uh, by the way, the mood bonus is going down because uh, there was that wedding and I had an artificial boost. So now everybody's coming down. It, it's the hangover phase, you know. Okay, we still only have the three. All right. That's fine. Oh, and I got to do some repairs. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot. I'm not, I am not uh, doing my thing at all. I'm not doing what I'm supposed to do. Okay, let's put you away and you away. Um, but I am curious about the, uh, I have poppies. Now, let's see, I've got, uh, I've got 144 poppies. Oh, and I've got rot on me. Ooh. Is it the cabbage? Yep, the cabbage rotted. Okay, that's fine. We can convert that into, uh, we can convert that into uh, uh, fertilizer, so I'm not too worried about it. Now, hey, I understand. Comp look at how slow they are, though. Like I could do that in, uh, like lickety split, but if, maybe not. He's doing. Is he doing four at a time? I think he might be. Okay, that's cool. All right. So apparently, I think you work on do poppies at the workbench. 
yes, poppy seeds. So if I want to, there we go, 144. Oh, it's super quick too. Oh, actually, before we do this, before we do this, let's take a quick look at the technology 9251.9. Okay. And uh, we'll do this. Now, of course, the all the rest of my crack team are uh, also doing work right now. So whatever increase in XP that we're going to get is an, amalgam an amalgamation of, you know, mine and theirs. I do stuff quicker, though. So the majority of what X XP we're going to get in the next few seconds is, is essentially coming from the harvesting of poppy seeds. I suspect that it is the same as um, threshing which is a 10 to 1. So uh, essentially this would be 139, would be 13.9 uh, XP, right? And yeah, we'll find out. <laughs> I think it was uh, 9251, if I remember correctly. 9251.9. So uh, 90, 9265. Uh, is that right? Is that what we're going to expect to see once we're done this? I think that's what we're going to... Somewhere in that region, 9265. Now, as I say, the, the, everybody else is doing work too, so it's not one-to-one, -one, but we're, we're going to see. Do, 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 do. Man, this is taking a little longer than I thought. Uh, I do have repairs I need to get to. That's okay. It'll eventually get done. We'll, we'll, we'll sort out the repairs. And then I want to make... Um, I want to make wine. <laughs> and we got to get those berries so we can make a bit of wine. I think that'd be that'd be awesome. Do do do. Almost done. Come on, poppies. I feel like uh, I feel like right now, like I'm processing poppies, and I, I feel like I'm, I don't know, doing something wrong. <laughs> Is it? This isn't exactly an opium den, but it's, uh, <laughs> you know. Oh boy. All right. There we go. And then if we take a look, it is 9286. I might have gotten those numbers wrong. Wow. Hmm. I wonder if there's you get more XP for processing poppies. But then, like, all these, they're doing all this work, too. So I think that that's just a function of them. All right. Um, let's take a look at what we got out of that. Uh, we have 144 poppy seed. Is that it? 144 poppy seeds? Um. So do you only get seed from poppies? Interesting. It's not bad. It's not bad. I think that that makes sense because the seed is what's used to replant, but seed is also what's used for um, uh, cooking. So, all right. That, very cool. Uh, I think we better get some work done, though. We better get some repairs done. Uh, <laughs> what are you doing up there? <laughs> He's like, I'm the king of my world. That and I'm not getting picked on up here. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. <laughs> Hey, piggies. Hi. Oh, hey, what are you all doing? All right. I'm not going to... I don't know. I, I'm just going to not worry about it. All right. Let's put away... I'm not going to sell the poppy seeds. We're, we're going to... Um, I'm going to put them in here so they don't cook with them um, or eat them. And then I'm also going to... Uh, we're going to keep some for planting. I'm going to... Before now and spring, we're going to put in some uh, conveniently placed poppy uh, little garden areas just for decoration i think that's a good idea and i'm gonna let's just dump the uh is it rot do i want to put rot in here no i want to put rot apparently i want to store rot in the food storage okay so let's put that away how much rot do we have by the way 78 wait a minute is that right I'm pretty sure that rot goes in the food storage. But I might be wrong about that. How much rot do we have in here? 1,943. Oh, I'm slow. I'm going to put it in the food storage and see what happens. Actually, you know what we should do? Oh, this is a good opportunity for this. Okay, so we've got a guy working in the, uh, in the barn right now. 
And so what we can do is we can pull the rot out of both the resource storage and the food storage, and we'll confirm, we can confirm that the, um, there we go. If we go into the, into the management and we go into the barn and we take a look at the tasks, we can see that, oh, there's no, yeah, that's fine. Fertilizer, rot. Oh, where are you getting the rot from? It's all in my inventory. Uh, let's give that a second. Okay, let's check that out again. I actually don't really know. Apparently, it's getting rot from somewhere. Uh, I'm not going to worry about it. Let's get let's put the rot in here and uh, call it a day. There we go. All right, now. Oh, sorry, sorry, De Labora. Oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, good. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. Oh, goodness gracious. All right, so repairs. We have to fix things. I hear you. <laughs> um, we need a few logs. Let's say we'll grab uh, 10. And we're going to need some planks. Let's say uh, another 10. There we go. And I don't know. Uh, some sticks, not that many, that's fine, and some, st ooh, we're low on straw. Okay, maybe that's going to be enough, we'll find out. Let's do some repairs, okay. Oh, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me. Do -do 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 -do. Excuse me, pardon me. I think I'm getting more flack is what what's happening. <laughs> Why aren't you taking care of this faster? <laughs> this place is a shambles. It's a shambles. <laughs> uh, we got a couple of damaged houses. One of them is down there. The other one is... Okay, so they're both in the village. I can deal with that. And then I think this is just the workshop it doesn't have a worker. Man, it's so much better. I, I agree. It, it, it looks so much better uh, trying to figure out what's damaged and what isn't. Okay, you look good. It looked like the, the, uh, the damaged buildings were down by the river, but I'm not seeing them. What is going on? It's tricky. Is it my house? No. It's good, isn't it? Okay. Where is the... Is it up here? It must be up here. Uh... <laughs> I am not sure what is dam... Oh, there's one! Okay, so we've got one taken care of. All right. And we still have a house damage, don't we? Now, it is a simple house, so it's not one of the uh, these little ones. It's one of these bigger ones. We've got a couple of them over there, so let's go and take a look. There's this one here that looks fine. Ah, oh, there it is. It's this one. There it is. Yeah, planks are definitely going to become... Uh, they're, they're the new thing that needs to be repaired all the time. All right. I think we're done. There should be no more damaged stuff. Yeah. it's This is just the workshop. Okay. We're good. Let's put that away. And we have important berry wine business to take care of. Uh, and we're... I, by the way, I'm keeping a lot of... Oh, my goodness. Uh, I'm keeping a lot of, like, the cabbage seed, flax grain, and linen thread. I'm keeping it in my inventory because we are going to be going on a... Uh, selling spree. We're going to sell some items, and uh, I just figure I, I would leave them in my inventory. Now, what do we need? Here, put the hammer away. What do we need to make uh, berry wine? I believe, is it water or just bit? What is it? Let's let's figure out the... Um, we have to make the juice first, right? So, we need uh, plum, pear, cherry, berry juice. 
So it's 20 berries, and then you need uh, wine bottles. Okay, so wine bottles and 20 to 1. Wine bottles to berries. Okay, and then once you get wine, is it a brewing station? And then you can convert uh, mead, rye, oh, ale, rye. No, no, not this. It's this one here, the wine barrel. Plum, pear, cherry, apple, berry. And it's literally one berry juice is one uh, one wine. Okay. So, uh, we have, um, actually, we can go over here and take a look. I think we got, we can access it over here, too. We have 1051, um, food, there we go, 1051 berries, right? And, uh, so I'm going to need a lot of bottles. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Let's make as many wine bottles as we can. Hang on. I gotta just... Okay. Everything's fine. We're not... Nothing Nothing bad is happening. Alruna's cool. She's, she's awesome. Don't ever let anybody tell you anything different. Uh, we've got 113 clay, which weighs f a fair amount. I'm gonna grab... Well, how, how much can I carry? Wow, we've actually almost maxed out our weight. Uh, okay, here's what we're going to do. Um, th let's do this. It's uh, it, it, This will make it a little, be a little bit easier, a little bit easier to manage. I'm going to drop the berries off in here. Excuse me, honey, I'm just going to drop some berries off in here. She's like, okay. All right. You know what she's going to do? She's going to make wine. I can just see her. She's, I'm going to come back in there, and she's going to be pressing that wine. Uh, it'll be amazing. <laughs> All right. Let's see how many uh, how many bottles we can make with um, 114 clay. I don't remember the ratio. There we go. And is it... Yeah, I think it's the pottery wheel. Let's find out. A wine bottle at five. So if we can make 22 wine bottles. Okay. Yeah. So let's make... Oh, my goodness. This is going to be a bit slow. Oh, boy. <laughs> I really need to get somebody working in here. <gasps> you know what I didn't do? Hang on. Hang on. Hold on there a minute. Hang on, buddy. we got to check something. Um, I forgot to check and see if anybody's come back. Rados to six. Oh, he's growing into a big, strong boy. Okay, um, if there's any moms that have, have re-entered the, uh, I don't think there is. Do we have any, okay, hang on, let me just double check. N N Nyrat, that's an interesting name. Okay. Hmm. Uh, if there was a, a new mom, would there would be a zero here? Somebody, like, this. these are the newest folks down at the bottom, and they would have zero. Their age would be zero. So there are new, no new moms, but do we have any moms? Okay, uh, we got Miro. Miro here is is uh, is a new mom, and she's she's got a one year old. So she's got maybe another. Well, it's hard to say because I don't. It doesn't do one point two, one point five years or whatever. So it could be any time now. She's going to come back into the into the job market. So she's almost ready. Henrika is almost ready to nadbor is one all right and oh nishtenka of course oh nishtenka, nishtenka had nyrat <laughs> why am i not surprised oh nishtenka <laughs> so we've got three three people that could potentially be uh entering the workforce again so that's cool i i, I can dig that all right, so while this is happening, um, let's see if we can try to make sure that I'm not forgetting anything. I still have to convert the oat fields into rye fields and make sure they're planted before the end of fall, right? If I if I don't do that, then we're not going to have enough uh, we're not going to have enough rye in the next turnaround of the season. So, okay, so that's that. Um, the other thing I could do is we could we could work on the palisade. Uh, that's actually not a bad idea. I might I might end up working on the palisade. 
but we'll see how time is going. Um, these wine bottles are definitely, definitely, and, and by the way, no, you know who you are. I am not, there's nobody breathing down my neck right now. <laughs> Tim, Tim, <laughs> Tim was invo invoking the, um, oh, what was it? Patrick Swayze and, uh. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, no. No, it's not that kind of village, Tim. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right. What I might do is I might do some of this off camera because uh, this is taking altogether uh, way too long. So, yeah, let's just... There we go. That's... that's Yeah. I have limits. All right. So, what we're going to do is I'm going to dump off the unused clay in, in storage. Do 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 like this, and uh, how many bottles did we get? Oh, I I I was assuming it was one to one. Okay, first of all, we've got wine bottles in here. I have seventeen. You know what? Um. No, let's just, let's just, uh, let's just do what we can. All right. Now, what is my weight at? 30? Okay. Let's try grabbing. Oh, right. I dumped the berries off in the, uh, in there. That's right. For convenience. Do, 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 do. I really like that, uh, stone wall. So we're going to have to do more of those too. All right. Let's grab half of these. We don't need to grab all of them. And, uh, first we're going to, Press some juice. So, berry juice. 18. And squeeze. <laughs> oh, it's very quick. Oh, look at that. We're already at four. Holy moly. Nice. I was worried that this was going to take a hor horribly long time, but it's not taking long at all. Good, 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 good. And then we're going to convert these into... Now, I think we get some... Well, the price in your inventory is somewhere between 200 and 240 uh, for each juice. Uh, for each wine, I should say. Now, well, let's take a look, actually, what, what the, uh, the difference is. So if we go in here, we'll see that the berry juice is um, 110. Now, uh, I think it'll more than double... No, we want to do... Oh, in here. This is where we want to do it. Okay. So they're worth 110. And I suspect that uh, we're going to come in around 240, 220, 240 uh, each. So uh, now that's that's the um, <laughs> MSRP. <laughs> of course, we sell uh, we sell the berry uh, the, or the ju we sell our products at a cut rate uh, wholesale prices. So it's not, you know, full cost. It's not what we would sell to the public. Um which is too bad. You know, it would be nice if uh, we had visitors and the tavern could make a little bit of money selling stuff to passersby. Like a, like a, a proper commerce. You know, that would be kind of cool. We could have, uh, oh yeah, we could have like a store where people could come by and buy other things like um, baked goods. and Well, the tavern, I guess, is probably the best bet. Hmm. I wonder if they're going to do that, if they're going to do that with the game. That would be kind of neat. All right, so this is going to be 18 wine. There we go. And the price on each one is 200. Okay, that's about right. So essentially converting uh, berry juice into wine double, well, it, it almost doubles the price, not quite. Okay. Yeah, all right, I can get behind that. And we can put uh, the rest of the berries away. There we go. And then what we'll do is... Do I have... How's my... Oh, the cabbage went bad. I need food. I need eaten stuff. Come on. Okay. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I need food. Okay. Should we go with the standard? I think we will. In fact, I'm going to go with... You know what? I'm going to splurge and I'm going to have the best cabbages. The finest cabbages. I'm going to grab 25 of them. And I th then we're going to have a little bit of a snack. Nice. All right. And a bit of water. Uh, 
Nice. All right. <whistles> Licorice. Attend me, mighty steed. Where are you? What were you doing over there? <laughs> Licorice is a is a is a horse of many uh, mysteries. Okay, excuse me. All right. We have uh, a p important business to attend to. Oh, actually, I was told here. Okay, we got to do this right. I was told if we if we're gonna have a, a proper rum runner. Um, then we need to store the uh, the, the the product. Um, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What? Oh, there we go. Okay, what? I couldn't see it for some reason. I couldn't see the wine. Yeah, we have to put the uh, we have to. We have to put the uh, our uh, product in uh, in the trunk, <laughs> hidden under a secret compartment, and then we have to drive very fast. Come on, licorice! I agree. This is very exhilarating. <laughs> nothing like nothing like being naughty, right, licorice? <laughs> All right, let's go find the seed lady. Nobody nobody suspects the seed lady. Where is she? She's not here. All right. I hear you. I hear you, Licorice. Just hang on a moment. There she is. There she is. Oh, we might have to go into the belly of the beast. Oh, no. I think we're fine. I think, um... Hey. Psst. Hey, hey, hey. I'll be right back. You ready? Yeah? Okay. Where's Unigost? He's way over there. All right, I think we're good. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't want to sell you a longbow. <laughs> oh, I did it. I did that. That was, yep. Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. I got my money back. Oh, we couldn't. <gasps> she She doesn't have the capacity for it. Oh no, that's terrible. That's terrible. She's like, okay, all right. Yep. I'm just going to step away, okay? Uh, Yarrow! <laughs> Yarrow, hi. Would you like to buy some, uh, <laughs> some cabbage seeds? And maybe some flax grain? There you go. Thank you, Yarrow. Ha <laughs> ha! All right. I think what we can do... Oh, we can talk to... Where's Sobomir? Uh, he should be up, actually. He's probably up here. Yeah, there he is. I agree. <laughs> Sobomir, what are you doing with that cow? All right. <laughs> um, oh, here. Linen thread. The cows will love it. Um, and then we can follow up with a flax grain chaser. How does that sound? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, diplomacy, new level. Nice. Okay, let's take a look at what we can do with that. Um, so we have two out of three for diplomacy knowledge. Uh, is there anything that I can think of that would be better? Like we could put some more, like, you know, increase our dynasty reputation point earning. Um Affection, I'm uh, not too worried about that. Barter. You know what? Let's get, let's do barter. For now. I may end up putting it into the, it'd be better if I did it with other points. Hey, uh, Unigost. Just for kicks and giggles. Uh, 150. Okay. I should have checked how much I was getting before. Oh, that's too bad. That's too bad. All right. Uh, we need to sell him some flax grain. There we go. I'm not so he nope, there's nothing Oh, I don't have any wine on me at all. <laughs> okay. All right, licorice. Our work here is done. We still have some materials left. Let's go and talk to Falibor. Betcha he would love I he he's a I I've heard Falibor is a bit of a party animal. So, I think he just would love to have a bit of wine. 
Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I think I jammed up on them. <laughs> oh, jeez. You know what? Let's just go through the water. Oh. That's actually really quick. Nice. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Weaving. Yeah, we've been partaking in our own product. All right. There we go. Ah. Hey, Falibor, are you... Oh, no, no, you don't get to go to bed yet, Falibor. <laughs> hey, look at his pants. They look pretty cool. There you go, buddy. It's party time. Ah. Huh? I know you. I know you like that. Uh, I don't think I have anything else I can sell you, though. All right, uh, I'll go now. <laughs> yeah, look at this. He's got the. Uh, he's got the two colored, like the hose with the two different colors. That's a pretty snazzy outfit, Falibor. I, I'm. He, you could. That's that's how you can tell he's a bit of a like he's a party dude. He's he's got those pants, so you know that he's. Uh, you know, he's yeah. He's gonna be partaking. No, you horses don't get to drink wine liquor. You, I know that the other horses have told you all about how good it is and how it's, uh, you, you know, have fun and all of that, but you're not. <sighs> you know what? Fine. <laughs> if you can find a horse, like a, a horse trough filled with wine, you can partake in it. All right. All right. He says it's cool. Uh, looks like our field has been, uh, harvested. So what we're going to do is let's go over to management and, uh, not management fields. All right. So the ones we're interested in are the, uh, I think it's, is it this one and this one? No. I can never remember what the symbol is for. Right, we're switching over from oats. This is the oat one. So we want to change this over into rye. There we go. And the other oat one, which is this one here. Right? Yeah. And we're going to change you over to rye. Nice. Well, all right. What do you think, buddy? Yeah? We did a good job today, didn't we? Did you did you find that exciting? I didn't leave anything in your saddlebags, did I? No. No evidence. Good. So, yeah. It was pretty exciting. It was exhilarating even, right? We we went, we went out there. We we were we were being I know, right under Unigos' nose. He didn't even suspect a thing. Good thing the seed lady is such good people, isn't she? Yeah, she's never going to snitch on us. Not in a million years. All right, uh, I think <laughs> I think this is a good place to stop. <laughs> uh, Licorice and I are going to take a break. In fact, what I'm actually probably going to do is, uh, if we come over here, we take a look. There is uh, some wheat that can be processed. I've got oat that can be processed, and then if we come over into here, let's grab uh, let's grab Licorice and we'll go take a look. I'm pretty sure we have some uh, rye. You, we've got more oat. Sorry, we've got oat we can process. And we've got flax. I don't want to hear about it. Okay, fine. All right. And boom, boom, boom. There we go. So yeah, in here, I think, I think, uh, we have, yeah, we have 1,590 flax. In fact, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to grab it. Uh, it has overburdened me, but we can, I can um, uh, ride uh, licorice over. So it's not a big deal. And the other thing is, do, 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 do. is there anything else we can grab out of here? Um, straw, sticks, poppy seeds. We're going to do something with poppy seeds. I'm going to try investigating what we can do with that. I think there's some cooking that we can do. Yeah, I don't see anything else. It must be in the uh, food storage. Let's go take a look. Um, we could put some stuff on licorice, actually. Uh, there's the oats. Okay, so there's 29.55 kilograms of oats in here. 
So, uh, what I can do for now is I will, um, oh, we should actually, here, uh, there we go. And let's take a look at animal feed. Yeah, we're out of animal feed. So I need to go and make some more animal feed. In fact, if we were to take a look at the animal pens, what's the situation here? 88%. The pigs, I think, are the worst at, uh, for keeping, no, 87. Okay. Uh, the, the geese are, are usually pretty good, 87. They're all fine. Uh, the horses don't eat much at all. Uh, 94. Yeah, so they're cool. All right, so we're going to have to make some animal feed. So, uh, that means I need to grab... I'm going to need to grab some oats. So we're going to grab the oats and... Hopefully, I'm not overburdened licorice here. Oh, excellent. Licorice is un, un, uh, undef <laughs> unaffected. <laughs> or reasonably unaffected. All right. All right, so um, here's the situation. So I'm gonna, we're going to end it here. Uh, I'm going to be putting the... Uh, the unprocessed grain or unprocessed stuff into the into the little storage box over there and then at night uh, for example overnight i can process some um, flax i can process some rye some oat and uh we'll we'll get that'll get us some straw and then i'll be able to make some animal feed and then we'll get some animal feed for tomorrow and also in the next one um i do want to take a look at what we can do with poppies i suspect that in the future it no it's not that kind of village. Here, let me, there we go. Not that kind of village. We're not building an opium den. Okay. So uh, I suspect that we're going to have uh, some medicinal product that can be made, like laudanum or something like that, that can be made from the poppies. But uh, we'll have to wait for that. For now, I believe there is like a some sort of poppy cake or poppy pie or something like that. Um, so yeah, we'll investigate that. And then what else are we going to do? Yeah, we're going to make some animal feed and we could work on palisades. We could do some more decorating, decorating. There's oodles of things that need to be done. All right. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.